stop in Denmark. Let's move on to look at uh, different areas on how we can get things done in different parts of the uh, country or in different countries we are going to be looking at. So guys, welcome to Amstein TV. You are watching Amstein TV. And in this uh, session, we are going to be sharing with you guys uh, professional jobs in Europe 2023, 2024 for international applicants. What are the professional jobs that are being in demand in Europe for this physical year that is what we are going to be sharing with you in this guy in this video guys remember it applies to different personalities with different qualifications from different parts of the world you may be in position of this talent but you are wasting it somewhere so let us give you a vivid look on how uh, the professional sector uh, being in demand in the europe some part of europe right especially the UK. Hundreds of thousands of jobs are available from the time to time in Europe countries, uh, that is the European countries. But the question that matters is if you can apply for any of these jobs or not, or how much are you going to pay to be paid for that professional job in Europe. And so if that is uh, what we have gathered as problems that people are facing we have listed some of the professional jobs uh, occupations in europe that pay immensely well to locals and as well as international job seekers whereas we are expecting that the companies in europe will be offering the following jobs in this rolling year 2023-2024 in back and this is why we recommend you to please start updating your CV, your resume as per new modern professional standard and try your professional lock in Europe 2023 and 2024. So list of the good salary jobs uh, and professions in Europe uh, will be, you can find great number of jobs in Europe, but as per our recommendations, you will get to know what is better. Now, let's see sales specialist professional in Europe are being in demand. When we talk of a sales uh, specialist professional, even though online retail and e-commerce are at an all-time high, still many people uh, enjoy a real-time shopping experience in stores. Those the demand for sales assistance in physical stores is still high in Europe, depending on what European country you decide to work in as a sales specialist or assistance and the amount of prior experience you have on average, you can easily earn between 1,500 euro to 3,000 per month. However, it will be essential for you to gain uh, fluency in the native language of the country you aim to go to, for example, German or French in the respective country, in addition to English proficiency, consider applying for this uh, sales specialist job in, uh, especially Netherlands, among European countries, Spain, France, Germany, and Italy offer many opportunities for sales specialists with average salaries in many other countries. In Germany, a senior and experienced skills uh, sales specialists can make up to 10,000 euros to 14,000 euros per hour. So that is per year and around 4,000 euros in France every month and about 2,200 uh, euros per month in Italy. So the earning potential varies and job protects uh, are very high as per jobs that are being in demand in Europe. So now we see at um, we look at secretaries and administrators profession in Europe. Are these jobs also in demand? We say yes. 18% of European countries are looking to hire foreign overseas individuals as secretaries and administrators this year. An increase from last year's 12% according to statistics provided by Manpower Group. 
the key here is being well taught in spoken and written english as english speaking employees are sought after for these jobs working as a secretary or administrator in europe could get you to earn a starting salary of 26,000. Uh, why those with prior experience can end between salary pockets of 35,000 to 49,000 yearly according to several online job search engines as they always uh, bring it to us so now that is it and we move on to telephone operators and distributive workers a professional in europe are being in demand so an increase in job opportunities for foreigners in europe is not just limited to it or that is information technology or other sectors mentioned above so telephone operators sales agents and distributive workers are also highly demanded by over 15 percent more european employers compared to previous years, especially in the case of Spain, where employers willing to hire foreign staff jumped from 16 to uh, 24% in a year. So even as that, the earning potential in these types of jobs is good across European countries or in London. Foreigners can earn over 12,000 to 17,000 euros on average per year. By, by working as a sales agent, uh, as a telephone operator in a call center. However, naturally, the average salary increases with experience. And if you are multilingual, that is a big plus point that could get you to earn greater than 20,000 even. So take note, if you are multilingual, it is an advantage for you as we are seeing it now. Let's move on. Number four, cooks and catering staff professional in Europe. Those are the uh, professions that are in demand in Europe. So now the cooking and the catering industry is another uh, notable mention where you can apply and grow as a foreign employee. Overall, 13% are willing and expect to hire foreigners as cooks, uh, cooking staff, and caterers. But you must be qualified with your certification at hand. You don't just wake up and you go and stand. You know how to cook without uh, any proof. So the prospects are lower in France because the employer uh, percentage fell from 16 to 10% this year. But Spain and the United Kingdom are ideal locations to make it as part of the cooking and catering industry. 25% of Spanish employers are looking to hire foreigners, whereas 20% of the UK uh, cooking and catering companies currently employ non-nationals and 15% employers are willing to hire foreigners this year. Here, if you are talented in cooking, uh, multiple cuisines or have experience in catering that will be a bonus point on your resume i know some people are very good uh, when it comes to the chef stuff but they are wasting it somewhere get up and pick your resume arrange them and find a way on how to get it to the right channel per year earning potential as a cook varies between seven thousand in spain uh, 12,000 to 19,000 in London, uh, 14,000 to 20,000 in Germany. However, if you wish to further maximum your earning potential in this industry, it is advised for you to become fluent in English language. English is the key and the choosing European countries' native language. That is their language. For example, if you are German uh, and English language fluent and are good at conversing with customers you can end within the salary bulk brackets of 17 to thirty thousand on the high side and that is how you get to go up there so now we look at number five uh, technicians and associate professional in europe technicians an associate professional where are you guys come out and answer your name in the distance um, 
learning sector, there's a growing need for technicians and associates, much of which is being met by foreign staff. Statistically speaking, across Europe, around 12% of employees or employers in this sector are on the lookout for foreign staff to fill in this growth. So those many uh, European businesses and companies are offering job opportunities to foreign technicians and RCG. London is notably uh, ahead as it is home to over 34% non-British technicians and RCG this year compared to last year's 33%. It is rising according to various statistical sources such as Manpower Group and Azuna Statistics. So the earning potential in several European countries is as we are going to be mentioned in Britain, foreign technicians and associates can end up to 8,000 uh, per year. On average, Germany is between 12 to 15 per year, whereas a range of 11 to 15 in Spain. For you to be sought after candidate in this industry, it is essential to have clear and fluent English speaking skills. Speaking strictly about Germany, if you are good at English and German both, you can earn a way better yearly salary of uh, over 45k on the higher side within a salary bracket of 28 to 40k overall, depending upon experience and native as well as English language fluency is concerned and you are good to go. So that is it guys, as we give you back to back. Now we look at Number six, a dentist professional, uh, dentist profession in Europe. Dentists are also in demand in Europe, as we can see. Dentists are universal need and thus their demand in Europe is ever growing. An average number of 1,800 dentists retired every year in each European country, leaving room for emerging talent, growing talent. So in the form of young uh, graduate specialists, this job is well paying and opens door for the private practice. Those, if you have uh, specialized in industry or uh, a bachelor's graduate moving to Europe to practice a good option, foreign dentists practicing in Europe can earn greater than uh, 100,000 per year on average. And that is a very uh, interesting salary, right? So for professionals, congratulations to you. It's your uh, opportunities. For non-professionals, let's keep uh, writing on to see if there will be nothing, uh, something for non-professionals. Uh, psychologists um, in jobs in demand. Psychologists jobs in demand. A few years back, uh, psychologists were considered luxury employees but now they are recruited across many industries and not just uh, limited to mental health facilities to assist differently abled individuals at a mental level. Now, psychologists are part of the interview partners of leading European companies. So those are part of the policies enforced and are needed for diagnosis in special needs schools, centers, or teaching facilities for adults, you will need a degree, uh, certification, or diploma to practice a clinical psychologist or behavioral psychologist. Foreign psychologists can earn 33k or more depending on experience and the employer at the time. So now we also get uh, here. Uh, engineers profession in Europe. Engineers are also in demand. Graduate of engineering specialist, uh, specialties are very welcome in Europe. In many uh, alone, there are over 52,000 new vacancies open for hiring foreign engineering specialists. And there is also a high rate of retirement in the coming year. Those the chances of finding a job as an engineer, be it chemical, mechanical, software, are high. Engineers can earn uh, more than 
key per year on average that is now let's uh, spoil and spotlight some of the biggest european engineering companies where their hr are always up for hiring international skills engineers as well as trainee international engineers and those companies to look for jobs in europe for engineering professionals we can see bosch uh, ab volkswagen airbus gas form Lokoi oil and volvo those are companies that are in need of employees especially engineers in europe not leaving out biologists professional in europe biologists professionals are also in demand in europe the european pharmaceutical industry continuously employs uh, biologists from foreign backgrounds that have impressive work experience so if you are highly qualified in this field go ahead and apply for biologist jobs in europe you can earn between uh, 3000 to 12k every month working as a biologist in europe and that will be a very good living for you in europe so guys that is it when it comes to uh, the jobs that are paying extremely well in Europe, as we have listed uh, it to you guys. If you didn't find your uh, profession, maybe in the next, uh, in other videos, there are, you are, uh, there are your professions there, they try to find out if at all you have your uh, professions there. And now we are sharing about how to get a job, how to find a job in foreign countries for international job seekers. We uh, There is also one important thing we need to